The Sultan of Sokoto Al Adil Sahad Abubakar III has charged governments at all levels to upscale intelligence gathering techniques. He was reacting to the killing of 115 persons on Christmas Eve in two local government areas of Plateau State. The government attacked 15 communities in Bakas and Barkinladi local government areas of Plateau on Christmas Eve, killed 115 persons, and destroyed 221 homes. The assailants also destroyed eight vehicles and 27 motorcycles. Speaking at the closing of the 80th National Islamic Vacation Calls, the Sultan said proactive intelligence gathering would help to avert such attacks and killings. Why do we keep on having these clashes? Why do we keep on having these deaths caused by ourselves? A couple of weeks back, the children very issue is still fresh with us. Now, the one at pla on the plateau. We always condemn such things, but after condemning such activities by these bandits and criminals, what's next? What are the roles of the government who are supposed to protect our lives and property? Why can't we be proactive? Stop such attacks before they happen. What happened to our intelligence gathering mechanisms? Anybody, you can never tell me that nobody knew such attacks were coming on in various places, whether it's in Sokoto or it's in Vindinkabi or it's in Kaduna or anywhere. Have we lost our sense of gathering information to avert any of such heinous crimes? We must ask our government to up the game because these bandits are always a step ahead. For some of us who are opportunity to have served in the military, we know the activities of the security agencies. So we keep on asking questions. What really is happening? Things are politicized. And that's the worst way to go when you politicize. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.